Hey, what's up guys? Sorry, I'm kind of late. <clears throat> this might be a short stream. I don't have too many things to do. Uh, we're just going to run like chapter 1 and 2 on the second spotlight mission for expert. And it's probably going to be it. <laughs> uh, what's up everyone? Uh, Slyers, Clash with Thunder, Vlog Adventure, Mila, Evil, Daniel, Ladies Man. What's up guys? <clears throat> Let's do a quick raid, I think. I think I'm about like 200 four star shards short of a f another four star crystal, so I think I might um, forge a bot at the end. Hopefully, that gives us enough. You really want me to get Galvatron? Yeah, I really want to get Galvatron too. I think he's pretty good. I faced him today in Alliance missions and he wrecked my rank 5 OG Prime. He just like one shot him uh, with his special 3, so it's kind of crazy. Um, spike in a load? Maybe. Also, I was doing Alliance missions without the Megatron relics for the past two days <laughs> until today. I wonder I was getting my my ass kicked. I was like, what? Did these bots get more tanky? But I just totally forgot to equip the Megatron relics. What's the fastest way to get tier 2 class sparks? Tier 2 class sparks, it would have to be through the daily... Um, special mission for whatever class is out there it sucks though because I think you can only get like one a week basically like you can only get like one warrior one tech one scout whatever because even on Sundays it's they have all of them but it's just the easy one or the tier one Ryan what's up man <coughs> Did everyone pick up their boost crystals from the raid store today? I think I picked up all five. I don't know why, but for some reason, like if you try to buy like more than two, the price increases by a lot. But if you just buy one and then you get out of the store, go back in and you can keep buying just one for the standard like uh, price. So I don't know if that's kind of weird or if that was inten intentional. Here, which way should we go? I guess we'll go MB1 route. <clears throat> I still think it really sucks that we don't get arena chips anymore from the arena, like from even winning the series. I thought for sure you would get like some uh, arena chips for completing the series, but nope. Currently, I think the only way you can get the arena chips is just by doing the away missions, and that kind of sucks, but every day you're getting the rank rewards. As long as these arenas keep only lasting like one day, um, you'll be able to get some arena crystals that way. Hey, Red Coder. Good morning, man. Freddy Galloway, I just noticed you, dude. <laughs> Ryan has 42,000 Galvatron chips. That is really good, dude. We're not even like a week in and you're already almost like halfway there. I think I'm at like 30,000, so quite a ways off, but I think as long as we complete the all of the expert difficulty or all of the missions, we should be good. Should be able to get it. Let's see, let's go ahead and start, I guess. I haven't done any of these guys. Um, we'll just run once through 
this first one first test and then we'll go over um, the second mission over my dead chassis <clears throat> tech 818 what's up man say hi to Erica let's see yeah, let's go ahead and use this team our OP team also guys guess what you guys are not gonna believe it um, I ended up taking all of my four star bots to rank two including um, this guy right here <laughs> can't believe I actually did it I took Mixmaster to rank two kind of a um, I don't know I shouldn't have done it <laughs> Don't worry guys, I don't think Mixmaster has um, successfully defeated somebody on a raid, so he's still not good in my book. <laughs> what a mistake you made. <laughs> I know, right? Probably did. I just had a bunch of alphas in, like, in stock or whatever, and I was like, oh, you know, whatever, I'll just do it. Which looks like the hardest route to go. Probably right, so we'll probably go right this time. <clears throat> she asked if he can take my account so I can get off my phone. <laughs> Tell her no. Gotta keep playing. Let's see, on ranged attacks, inflict a stack of shock dealing 100% of attack as shock damage over 7.5 seconds. Oh man, that's gonna be super annoying. Here comes the cheating with Ratchet. Yep. Please and Hobbs, I asked you a question on line chat, but you never answered. Oh, my bad, dude. Um, I don't really check my line app anymore. I check it every now and then. Probably like once or twice a week. I'll try checking it after this live stream. All these are gonna have the same thing, right? Sharkticon local mod. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Just making sure. Let's see here. I guess this is this is an all tech route. I think. Probably should have gone a different route, just so I can use a little bit of everybody. Nah, we'll still use everybody. Look at that OP heal coming in. Oops. Power burn, what? Since when does that do power burn? <clears throat> Master Nick, I bought 26 Galvatron crystals. I got a four star Galvatron and I ranked him to rank four. Awesome, dude. How do you like him? Is he, is he everything you hoped? I've heard mixed stuff about him. I hear some people say Megatron's a little bit better, but I don't know. I think Galvatron might be better than Megatron, but let me know your thoughts. Ladies, man, 2 and 7, why are you sorry? Dude? I think most of these characters we can probably beat with just like a special uh, one. Maybe some shots. <clears throat> Sorry, I thought I said something wrong, but you didn't know about it. So that makes it okay. Okay. We're good, dude. Don't worry about it. <laughs> 
The question I asked you online was, how does your OG heal so much? Mine barely does. Um, do you have a 3-star ratchet or a 4-star ratchet with your OG Prime? Also, don't forget, it's based off of his, uh, his base health. So since mine's rank 5, his base health is pretty high up there. That's why you see him heal like 108 um, HP per second. So I guess it's gonna end up depending on uh oh, okay yeah it's a three star ratchet. Um Oh we got ambushed. Nice. Can we click on let me show you real quick. This is what makes the ratchet OG Prime synergy like really really strong. Has to do with ratchet synergy. I think a three star ratchet only heals um OG Prime like three percent. Uh, four star ratchet heals uh, 10% so that's why you see a huge difference in healing between the three star ratchet and the four star ratchet <clears throat> now he's gonna get him by chips I am gonna end up getting Galvatron just by just by using the chips oh look at that we got ambushed by Galvatron he is not on a mod though. Let's go ahead and fight him with our sound wave, I guess. I heard there would be a raid event where you get Galvatron chips. Oh, you're right. That's where the chips are going to be coming from. I think it's like every other week or like next week or something. No wonder. I thought, yeah, I totally misread it then. I thought like every raid that you won or something, you would get like. A small amount of like Galvatron chips, but I think I remember now. They are gonna have an event for him. Damn that crit though. That was like a 2500 crit. <clears throat> Blazing Hobbs, just start saving up your uh, four star crystals, dude. Whenever they add Ratchet to the four star crystals. Just pop them all open let's see okay so we don't get confused in later we'll just keep going right do you have to get them by raid points or by finishing raids uh, no actually um, you don't get them anywhere uh, during the the raid event though, I think you do get them by just winning raids uh, during the event. I wonder if the sonic shield... oops, lag. I wonder if the sonic shield... Uh, my range attacks that get deflected, I wonder if those inflict a uh, shock on me. I don't think so. Oh my god. I lag so bad there. Always remember to backstep guys whenever Soundwave ends up like hitting you with like a 5 hit combo. He's always, always like 90% of the time he's gonna finish it with a heavy. And if you just stand there, you're gonna get hit. So just back up and you'll be fine. I'm about to, but it's hard for me to save. I know, dude. I can never save my four star crystals. I still, still really want to dupe my drift, my prowl, MV1. I want to get barricade, and it looks like it's never gonna happen. Yesterday, or not yesterday, was it yesterday? No, it was like two days ago during the live stream. I pulled another sound wave and another waspinator. A little, a little depressing, but at least we didn't pull another mix master. Let's go ahead and fight this tech shark decon with our motor mastery. Wonder what the other mods on this star screen are gonna be.
<clears throat> Ooh, Shockwave is up next. God, I can feel my game lagging like so bad. Uh, I wonder if I should restart. Should I restart? Mm, nah, let's keep going. Hopefully this doesn't like, oh God, I think my game's like frozen now. All right, let's just do it, who cares? <laughs> I duped my 4 star MV1 to rank 3, and I pulled a 3 star Galvatron yesterday. Nice, Ryan. That's awesome, dude. Congrats. I my friend from work. He pulled, uh, he opened up 5 crystals, and he ended up getting a 3 star Galvatron and a 4 star Ramjet. I was like, what? Lucky. And then, of course, I come home, I stream, and I end up uh, getting a bunch of two stars. <clears throat> Who should I rank up to rank 4 using only my only one alpha spark? Drift, King of Bleeds and Swords, or Hot Rod the Crit Dancer? Oh man, that's actually a tough one. I'm starting to like Hot Rod a little bit more. Um, but I still think I would do probably end up doing Drift. Just looks way cooler. Shadow Gaming, what's up man? Glad to see you here. How's my day going? Pretty good. <clears throat> Let's see here, health boost 3. He's got range shock, armor pierce, Hacked aim enhancer, basic range attacks are unblockable, and projectile speed randomizes throughout the fight. Special 3 is unlocked. Oh man, am I ready to get pounded by Starscream? Nope. Let's test, let's test Starscream a little bit. Let's see how a ratchet does. Watch me get obliterated. Null ray incoming. Oh my god, I can't even hit him. <laughs> this is this is why this no oh jeez. Alright, it's over guys, our ratchet's done for. Starscream is way too, too strong. <laughs> Don't let a Dorito chip, chip kill you. It's too late for that. My poor, poor ratchet. Insta-killed. <clears throat> I really wish I had a 4 star Starscream. He would have def I would have definitely taken him up. I think he's like super strong. That Null Ray just completely obliterates a bunch of uh, bots. Like nothing. It's pretty crazy. Let's see how our sound wave does against him. I can't believe like the lag hasn't been fixed or anything like that. It's one of the things I hate so much right now about the game. And for some reason, like it just started happening like recently, where during my arenas, I'm doing my arenas and then randomly my game will just crash. And it only happens during the arenas, and I don't understand why, but it gets a little bit annoying. Should be dead here. <clears throat> Soundwave wins. <laughs> oh 
Rocky, what's up, man? First test complete. All right, what's next? <laughs> what the fuck? He made it look easy. Soundwave. I think Soundwave is like, or was pretty underrated for the most part, but he's actually super strong, I think. <laughs> look at that. Ultra Magnus all the way at the end. I heard some horror stories about Ultra Magnus. Let's see what he's got. And the, all the mods he's got. Let's see here. Um, what? I can't scroll down. Oh, there we go. That's weird. So I can't scroll down, guys. If, if my finger's like on the right side, I have to be like on the left side of this node info to scroll up and down. It's kind of weird. <laughs> Let's see here. Special attack stun four. On the last hit, a special attack stuns the opponent for 3.5 seconds. Reflect ranged. Uh, okay. Block proficiency reduces incoming damage from enemy attacks that are successfully blocked. And what does the special 3 do? Oh, special 3 unlocked. Oh, it doesn't sound too bad. <clears throat> Should we switch up the team a little bit? <clears throat> Yeah, let's back out real quick. We'll switch out our brawlers. <clears throat> Probably just MB1. Since there's no uh, bleeding opponents, I hope, on this stage. Who should we take, guys? Uh, should we take Bone Crusher, Hot Rod, or Drift? Take Mix Master, they said. It'll be it'll be fine, they said. Mix Master will help you. <clears throat> I opened a premium and got a four-star waspinator. Nice man. Take drift. Alright, I see three drifts, so we'll take drift with us. Get that incoming bonus. All right, let's keep going the rightmost path again. <clears throat> what are these people on? Reduces incoming damage from enemy attacks that are blocked. That's fine. Should be okay. McBeans, what's up, man? All right, hopefully this uh, mission energy refill can take us all the way to Ultra Magnus. I probably should have restarted my game though. Oh my god, guys. <laughs> We're starting off. We're off to a great start with our drift. Let's try and save up here for a special three. I swear I didn't do a heavy. Alright, we're gonna restart the game after this fight, guys.
should be it. There we go. That wasn't too bad, actually. Who is the better tactician, Optimus Prime or Starscream? <clears throat> Definitely OG Prime, dude. I still think OG Prime is for sure the best. Maybe the best character overall in the game. At the moment, at least. Alright, let's go ahead and restart. <clears throat> Answer me, who is the best warrior bot? I think Bone Crusher and Drift, they're pretty good. Maybe, but I would say Bone Crusher just a little bit more, uh, simply because of his signature. Um, every bleed stack on the opponent reduces their power gain and their attack, and it increases Bone Crushers for the same amount. And as well as any time the enemy uses like a special, I think uh, Bone Crusher gets like a crit buff, if I'm not mistaken. Dynamic Yoshi, Ayo, what's up, man? Let's go ahead and use Soundwave. William, what's up, man? Alright, hopefully the lag is kind of gone, just for a little bit, so we can get through some more of these fights. Still debating who to take up to uh, rank four guys. I really want to do my sound wave, but I know I should probably wait and do my uh, my ratchet just for alliance missions because I always use ratchet, motor master, and OG prime, and it works out really well for the most part. But I think I do need to take at least another tech up to uh, rank four, and if it's not sound wave, it's gonna have to be uh, ratchet. <clears throat> uh, Jerry Knight, you still don't have Galvatron? I do not. I wasn't able to pull him from the crystals, and we might open up another crystal or two from the Galvatron chips at the end of the stream. Um, not Galvatron chips, from the Galvatron crystals. Um, but other than that, I don't think I'm gonna buy the three star Galvatron um, just yet. I really want to get the four star one first. Just, you know, make sure I'm able to get the four star one. And then if I'm able to, I'll definitely get the three star. Imagine how much damage a four star squeaks can do. Oh my god. Don't even bring up squeaks. Squeaks is the devil. He's, he's right there, right there on my list with uh, Nyx Master. Who should I rank 3 next? 4 star Ironhide, Rhinox, or Windblade? All not duped. Um, I would say Windblade out of those three, just because of the signature. I guess her signature doesn't really... Um, I guess it's the least impactful out of the other ones. Soka Playboy, thanks man. You rock as well. Alright, let's keep going right path. I wonder if the rest of these have the same mod. Yeah, okay, reduces incoming damage.
who is the best demolitions bot. I think Ironhide. I think he's still the best one out of the current six or seven, however many they have. And <clears throat> I guess until I get Galvatron for sure, I'm gonna say Ironhide, but I think Ironhide will still be a little bit better than Galvatron overall. We are fighting the Conehead Ramjet. Oh god, please stop hitting me. Gotta watch out for Ramjet Special 2. That thing comes out of nowhere. Kind of like uh, Starscream Special 2. For a special one here. Ooh, stun and power leak. Nice. Alright, you should be dead here, I think. Oops. There we go. That did it. <clears throat> Ice cream head. I might use that to cool me off. <laughs> Galvatron or Megatron? That's a tough one, dude. Um, just by based off the descriptions, I would say Galvatron. But I have to play, or I have to actually like play with Galvatron first, just to, I guess, form a better opinion. Uh, but I just think Galvatron overall because you can inflict like instant damage when you get those thirty charges, and then you use a heavy attack. And with Megatron, you actually have to stack and pair charges on the enemy and then use a heavy for it to proc. So I think it's easier for Galvatron to um, output more damage. I don't know if that makes sense. This MV1 is going to die so quickly. Never mind. <laughs> Uh, let's see Rex me. Alright, that was actually pretty quick. Can you get a two-star Galvatron? If so, how? I don't think uh, you can get one yet. Um, who was the guy that said earlier? I'm sorry, I already forgot. Uh, someone said earlier, and I do remember them mentioning this, they're going to have a Galvatron raid event, and I'm pretty sure you'll be able to pick up a two-star Galvatron from there. So we just gotta wait for that, which I think it, honestly, it might be this Sunday, the Galvatron raid event. Pretty sure it might be this Sunday. If not, it'll be next Sunday for sure. Let's go ahead and fight this side swipe with our drift and hopefully we're able to kill him. See you later, Yoshi. Thanks for stopping by, dude. Always try to keep a mental note of how many stacks or melee hits you've done on a side swipe. Oh, we're done for, guys. <laughs> He's too strong. Went too many crits. See how far we can go. Once I'm like super low health, I just start basically smashing buttons and trying to output as much damage as possible. Wow, Sideswipe, no fatality. He just let me uh, time out. <laughs> Rip. <clears throat> Answer me, how do you get fast four star shards? You gotta play the bounty arena, man. That's where they're all at. 
That's where all the good stuff's at. I think I'm better than Logan Paul. Thanks, dude. I don't know if that's a compliment or an insult. I'm just kidding. Freaking sideswipe. Kind of hurts. comments block your video footage how do I get rid of that uh, what do you mean <laughs> uh, Jerry says does tactic Optimus Prime re what I don't know what he said dude Ryan said from a scale 1 to 10 how much do you love 4 star OG Prime um, 10 10 out of 10 Would Megatron be a good Demolitions bot to use always? Definitely, dude. I think Megatron's pretty strong. I think I ranked him second behind Ironhide, but he may be third now that Galvatron got introduced, but I think he's still a strong bot overall. Uh, let's see how far we can get with some of our other characters against Ultra Magnus. I know his special 3 is unlocked, and on the last hit of a special attack, stuns the opponent for 3.4 seconds. Let's use Motor Master a little bit. I haven't actually played too much with Motor Master. That class disadvantage going. Oh, I forgot he's going to nullify all of our... Uh, all of our attacks. I'm doing like no damage now. That sucks. Go, Motor Master. Hit him with your pillow punches. I can't see shit. Go ahead, use your special too. You know you want to. For sure here guys. I think Lord Master did pretty well though. <clears throat> Damn, I thought he was gonna block right there at the end. Zill01, what's up man? Haven't seen you in a long time, dude. Has anyone had a bug where you can't switch to another bot? Yes, I've had that bug. It's super annoying. Let's see if Ratchet can take out Ultra Magnus. Actually, no. <laughs> Ratchet's not going to be able to do anything. I mainly use Ratchet like uh, from afar with range attacks. But Soundwave's special, or his heavy, yeah, there you go. He can't block the heavy. Oh god, we're still getting wrecked. Pretty bad, I think. I 
probably like restart the game before every boss battle. <laughs> oh my god. That was actually super close. I think I got really lucky there with that special. <laughs> Over my dead chassis complete. Let's see, what else do we get? Alright, so we got 6,500 tier 1 alpha essence. We got 1,000 tier 3 basic. And I think that's it. Michael, what's up, man? Chapter 3 now? I'll save chapter 3 for next week. I don't want to buy, um, what do you call it? The stupid, um, Oh, it's only two chapters. Oh wow, I thought there would be way more. We'll do uh, this next chapter, we'll do chapter three next week, guys. Let's see, what are we at now? We are at, oh, what am I doing? Let's see how many chips we're at. All right, we're missing 66,000. <laughs> Five paths in chapter three, holy crap. That's gonna be, it's gonna be, that's gonna be a good, good stream, guys, for next week. Let's see, is it crystal time? Probably. Um, this stream will probably be kind of short. Um, I don't think I have much else to do in the game. I was gonna, I was gonna go get some food right now. Let's see here. Currently, oh, by the way, guys, um, it is region locked. Um, I ended up getting rank thirty-four with one point one million. And that got me one or two percent in the crystal bounty arena. So let's see here. It's actually not too bad, one or two percent, just the hundred crystal, hundred four star crystal difference. So yeah, I guess that's something to go based off on. Probably like around eight hundred thousand points guarantees you one or two percent. Not hundred percent sure though. But let's see how far this gets me. I think I might be able to do like one or two more runs uh, probably get like around 1.5 million and then tomorrow I'll see just how good or what rank I got but let's go ahead and open up some crystals real quick have my five boost crystals should we open up some more Galvatron crystals guys let me know what you guys think <clears throat> in the meantime let me check real quick all right so I'm missing 224 star crystal shards who can I forge who can I forge <laughs> kabam trolling incoming yes definitely let me see which one of these guys will probably give around 200 let me see Level 10, I don't think that'll be enough. Let me see, what's Rhinox at? Open 20 Galvatron crystals? No, I think I'm only gonna open up probably like five and then forge mix. Oh, you're right, where the hell is my mix master? Was he all the way in the bottom? He was at the bottom. Yep, <laughs> I haven't even touched him. What does this do that? Concussive block 10. All right, let's go ahead and forge our, yeah, let's forge our mix master into our mix master. I just like unlocking everybody's uh, forge level 100. This is so wrong. This feels so wrong, forging mix master. I feel sick to my stomach doing this, but it will give you 135. Oh man, really? Oh well, we'll get rid of Mixmaster. 131. Ooh, that sucks. Alright, we gotta forge one more, guys. Which one of you don't I use? Oh, Bludgeon. Yeah, I can forge Bludgeon. Let me forge Bludgeon real quick. Where is Bludgeon? Here he is.
<laughs> Fuck, 131. Nah, you're good, dude. Don't worry about it. Alright, I think this was enough to get ourselves another 4 star. Yep, that's enough. Alright, let's go ahead and open up 5 of these and then we'll do the 4 star crystal. Let's see what we get. Are you high? Just do it. Level him up some first. Nah. <laughs> Makes Master brought you nothing but pain. I shouldn't even hesitate to forge him. That's true. But it just felt bad forging Mix Master into Mix Master. I should have at least forged him into somebody I actually liked. Um so yeah. <laughs> Pop him. Nah, we're gonna go ahead and uh, just do them one at a time. The suspense, the tease. I like getting teased by Kabam guys, look at that. Right in between two four stars. I like getting my hopes up and then having them just crash. <laughs> You're gonna mix. Man, I'm gonna be so mad if I get a four star mix master tonight. Never again. Watch, that's probably what it's gonna be. The mix master curse is gonna continue. Oh, Galvatron. Oh, we landed on Shockwave. Not bad, I guess. As we got a three star. Knock on wood. Nah, I don't believe. I don't believe. We have like less than like 10% chance at getting a mix master, so. I'm just gonna cross my fingers. <laughs> Holy shit, we actually got him, no freaking way. <laughs> Alright, that was that was worth it. Totally worth it. Almost 20 crystals later guys, we finally got a, a Galvatron. Be able to do a gameplay video on him. Two star wretched. <laughs> <clears throat> we did it guys, we pulled Galvatron. Limited time offer, 4 star bot crystal, 2500 energon, no thank you. We do not have the energon anymore. Galvatron will make me happy. I hope so. Ain't that bad. <clears throat> Alright guys, let me hear it in the chat. What are we getting tonight? Are we getting a mix master? Because we forged him. Um, hopefully we get a prowl. Yeah, we hopefully we get a prowl, a drift, MB1. Any one of those I'll be happy with. Even like a new bot. Um, out of the three that I don't have. Uh, what is it? Ultra Magnus, Rhinox, Barricade. I would like to get Barricade. If possible, or even hot rod, getting a hot rod dupe would be good. You're getting Kabam Troll, that's what you're getting. I don't disagree with that dude. Pretty sure I'm gonna get um cucked right now. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got. Hopefully we hopefully I don't end up rage quitting. Oh man, one right before Prowl, we got super close. I might end up just taking Bone Crusher up to rank uh, 3 now. He's at signature level 15. The rest of my warriors are not duped, except for what's his name? Did anyone say Bone Crusher? Nope, I don't think anyone said Bone Crusher today. Damn, we were close though, guys. We were pretty close. And my game just crashed. <laughs> That's awesome. <clears throat> Let's check out uh, what's his name, Galvatron, real quick. Can I do an Infinity Streak video? Yeah, someday I'll do one.
Yeah, not bad guys. We got the dupe, so we got an extra 10,000 Galvatron chips. So we're getting there. Slow and steady, we're getting there. Let's see, where is Galvatron at? Open one more, two more. I can't, Jerry. Can't do it. It's pretty cool. I heard that to rank him up, it actually costs um, demolition. Uh, not demolition, brawler sparks. Is this true, guys? What is my best streak? Arena streak? I think it was like 190 or 180. I don't really remember. I'll check my commander profile right now. Oh, they fixed it. Okay. Wow. <laughs> I'm glad they fixed it. That was so dumb though. So when I kabam hit the wrong button. Highest arena streak, 190. Um, yeah, alright guys, uh, I think it's gonna be it for the stream, probably tomorrow I'll post like a gameplay video with Galvatron, and, oh yeah, forgot to see how many Galvatron chips we're at now, 44,450, nice, and then hopefully tomorrow with the Crystal Bounty Arena, I'm able to get top 1 or 2% again, and then tomorrow there's actually another Crystal Bounty ar Arena, so hopefully next week we'll have enough for another four star crystal more than likely we will hopefully we don't have to keep forging our bots to get more crystals but yeah guys hope you guys enjoyed the stream and then next week we will continue on with chapter three i guess during the week i'll start clearing out um, the re remaining paths for chapter one and chapter two and then next week we'll do chapter three on stream uh so thanks a lot guys for tuning in and i'll see you next week thanks